Misaka Mikoto's codename is the Railgun for a reason. She's a military weapon given the Japan treatment of turning everything into anime girls. This attack is one of the most iconic in the Toaru franchise and anime as a whole. But how does it even work? Time to find my old physics notepad as we explore how Misaka's railgun came to be and the real science behind it. Misaka is the only Esper or psychic ability user who grew from a weak level 1 to one of 7 super powered level 5s. While her Electromaster ability isn't unique in the sense that other Espers in Academy City also have that power, she is reputed as the strongest Electromaster, unless you count Mugido Shizuri, the 4th rank level 5. Nevertheless, Misako can apply her ability in a variety of applications, which Mugano cannot. This includes magnetism, hacking, creating microwaves, to name a few. But how can I forget her famous railgun? She first discovered how to use the railgun one year before the start of the main timeline, where she had to break a target using a ball. Misaka decided to boost its voltage to propel it, and then began to imagine a set of rail lines heading towards her target, experimenting using Fleming's left hand rule by creating a magnetic field where she could then launch the ball using Lorentz Force. Unleashing this force caused a devastating blast as Misaka completely missed her target. However, thanks to this game, she discovered what would become her trademark application of her Esper power. But what is Fleming's left hand rule and Lorentz Force? The rule is used to determine the flow of motion in motors. So I guess we can call her Misaka Motokoto. Okay, I'm sorry, that was pretty shit, not gonna lie. The rule is meant to show that the the force of the motor is perpendicular to the magnetic field and current, with Misaka using this to calculate the direction of the magnetic field towards her target. Meanwhile, Lorentz force is what real railguns use to fire an electrically conductive projectile. It is directed perpendicularly towards the magnetic field and the current flow, with it travelling parallel to the rail lines. To fire the railgun, Misaka usually fires it from her thumb, although she can flip the coin midair to then fire it. According to data from the system scan where Misaka tested her railgun, it was stated to have an initial velocity of 1,030 meters per second, a continuous fire rate of 8 shots per minute, and a trajectory deviation of 18.9 millimeters. Rather than firing real coins that are part of a currency, Misaka chooses to fire her signature arcade token coins as the projectiles for her railgun instead. She can fire them at three times the speed of sound and are powerful enough to pierce a car, destroy a helicopter, and break through a nuclear shelter. But owing to the sheer speed and penetrating power of the railgun, it is likely they can go through even larger targets. Misaka's standard railgun attacks using the coins usually have a range of approximately 50 meters, as the coin burns up and melts by the time it surpasses that distance. Kamijo Toma, with his Imagine Breaker ability, was even able to nullify the attack and grab the coin as it hadn't reached the max distance. However, there are different applications of her railgun that changes the range, speed and power of the attack. For example, Misaka has shown to be able to fire multiple coins at once in the mental art manga. She can also use railgun on much larger targets which she punches to launch them. Larger objects vastly increase the power and range of the attack compared to when she uses arcade coins. And in Railgun Season 3, she fired a Giga Railgun from the hand of her Iron Sand Kaiju she created for even more destructive power. It is also implied Misaka has another variation of the Railgun, known as the Rail Shotgun, although she has never tested this technique, and it would be more difficult to execute due to neighbouring electromagnetic fields interfering with each other. Misaka has also shown to use Railgun on multiple robot parts at the same time, and she even created a metal ball using her magnetism to then fire as her railgun. While Misaka's level 4 ranked clone Misaka Worst also demonstrated using a less powerful version of the attack, it is not considered as a true railgun, or you could call it nail gun, since Worst prefers to use 2cm steel nails for her ammunition. It is not quite the same as Misaka's railgun, despite the similarities, as Worst does not use Fleming's left hand rule, instead simply firing it using magnetism similar in function to a magnetic rifle. Worst's nail 
Eldorn is also not as powerful due to this, and she is only a level 4 Esper in comparison to Misaka, who is a higher rank at level 5. And it only travels at the speed of sound, rather than 3 times the speed of sound with Misaka's version. Don't get me wrong, it's still impressive. Arguably the most devastating version of the attack is the Liquid Proof Railgun from the Index Light Novel, with a piece of technology known as the Anti-Art Attachment, or AAA, which borrows a portion of Alistair's magic and the support of Shokuho Misaki. She is able to launch a railgun attack which endlessly accelerates, allowing it to even pierce the walls of the windowless building. This is because Shokuho's mental out doesn't just control the minds of her victims. Its true function is to manipulate moisture, and she could use this with a coat of liquid on the coin's surface to continuously cool it as it's fired, so the coin does not melt away as it would with a traditional railgun. And so, the liquid-proof railgun can continue indefinitely if Shokuho continues to use the ability on it. Also, if you would like to see me explain how Shokuho's mental out works, then help me get to 22k subscribers and I will make that video. And let me know down below in the comments what ability you would like me to explain next on the channel. And don't forget to watch this video on screen right now, which explains all of Misaka's abilities, equipment, and forms. Thanks for watching and I'll see you all next time. Bye bye.